Hey loves, Miss Shelly Sims here and welcome or welcome back to my channel. So that as you guys can see by the machinima at the beginning of today's video, we are in a flashback. We are in a flashback from Delaney's childhood. We are pretty much picking up when she has just turned 10. You guys seen at the end of the machinima, Delaney was a child. It was her birthday yesterday and she is officially 10. She has lost her first tooth. It is just all in, it's just all blissful for her. So right now, like I said, we are in in Copperdale so we are starting this episode in Copperdale so we are not in Oasis Springs like I said this is a flashback but I do want to share a little bit of Delaney's story I feel like it is very important so you guys can see her upbringing you guys will know a lot of things that she went through and faced when she was younger so you guys will see that as we go I'm not going to do too many episodes of her in her childhood and if you guys hear a little bit of snoring I'm sorry my son is literally right here he won't let mama put him down <laughs> but let's go ahead and get into today's video but right now Delaney's mom her name is Amy I'm pretty sure you guys are like okay we need to know a little bit about Amy but it is literally 6 p.m. and Dale just came home from um, taking Delaney out for a bike ride she did just lose her very first tooth so she he was like okay the tooth fairy did bring her some money but what was more important is that her dad got her a bike and she is actually like ready to go inside and tell her mother all about things but oh my goodness look at this you guys this was autonomous he's like hey babe I went out and took Delaney out for a bike ride but I also got you something and she's like oh my god oh my god oh my god it is so beautiful babe it is so beautiful how does it look on me he's like of course it is it is gorgeous and Delaney is just over here she's looking at her parents she's like oh my god mom and dad are so in love she's like ew get a room Ugh, get a room and she's like well mom 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 hey guess what dad took me out to ride a bike oh my god really Delaney well we are actually going to be going somewhere it is a little bit cool outside today which I'm actually going to change that because they are literally a dead slap in the actual summertime but he is also just gifting his wife so many gifts and Delaney is just over here looking she's like oh my god I hope one day I have a love like mom and dad she's like ugh, so much but I'm gonna go outside and ride my bike mom okay Delaney go ahead and they are just in there they are in so much love with each other you guys and Delaney is just like oh my god I hope one day I can find oh my god did you leave I think she actually left her bike at the um I think she left her bike at Oasis Springs she's like oh my god dad 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 I think she's gonna run in here and she's gonna say dad I left I left my bike over in Oasis Springs and she's just gonna come in here panicking she's like dad dad mom hello anybody listen to me um i'm here she's like okay okay what is it kiddo what is it dad i left my bike yeah, over in oasis springs oh give me a hug kid okay we'll go get it let's let's go get it um babe she's like mom can, can we can we please go over there she's like yes delaney let me go grab some clothes and oh my god can you two love birds calm it down just a little bit let me cut off she's like oh okay delaney let me come in here grab me some clothes and then we can go over there and get your um bike from over at oasis springs i don't understand why y'all left her bike over there anyways so she's gonna come in here and go ahead and get on some clothes it is fairly warm but she's just gonna throw on something simple they're just running over there to get um Delaney's bike and she's like okay kiddo are you ready to go let's go get your bike yes dad please please let's go they just made it here in Oasis Springs. And of course, here is Delaney's bike. Thank the God that they, it was not stolen from the kids here. They're like, come on, Delaney. I see your bike. It's over here. Come on, go get your bike. Oh my goodness, girl. Who leaves their bike at Oasis Springs Park? They literally had to drive like 20 minutes over here. But he's like, come on, get your bike, Delaney. Jesus, you, I'm going to have to do stuff myself. And she's like, thank you, babe, for bringing her over here to get her 
her bike. All right, babe. Well, I'm going to go in and actually get some food. Okay, well, Delaney, do you want to go play in the park? She's like, no, mom. I actually want to take a picture with you. Okay, well, let's actually take a picture together then. I am okay with doing that. Let's make these memories. And she's going to be like, let's um take a photo together. Oh, my God. I forgot they can't take photos together, can they? Oh, no. Okay, well, we'll have to end up taking one eventually. But she's like, go play, Delaney. Um, she's like, okay, mom, well, come over here with me. I want to play with you. You want to play with me? Yeah. Okay, well, uh, let's see what we can do. Let's <laughs> get on the handlebars. And mom's going to be like, well, I, I think I'm just going to probably sit it out. But I'll watch you, kiddo. Dad's getting food. Okay, mom, fine. I won't make you embarrass yourself on the, <laughs> on the monkey bars. I'll just, you know, play by myself. And we were actually supposed to take Delaney over to San Sequoia today but she really was just all up in the the fact of you know she was just like riding her bike and things like that and it seems that her dad actually wants to help her ride her bike again it is getting a late but Delaney's mom is sitting over here and she is just like thinking like oh my god I am so lucky to have my Laney bug and my lovely husband oh my goodness Dale really does make Amy feel so loved and so supported and so taken care of and she's just over here just like looking she's looking at them over there wow the stars are in the sky and so forth and she's like they are just so I don't know they're just they're just the love of my life like both of them are the love of my life he is helping Delaney with her bike he's like oh Laney bug you got this she's like okay dad I know I we've went over this oh you just wanted to show off for mom huh yeah I kind of wanted to show her that I got it but it's getting a little bit difficult Ugh, I don't know what it is. Maybe it's this pavement we practiced in the dirt. Oh, you got it, girl. Just just keep on trying. And I think that she is still over there. Even though there's people talking, she's over there. She's looking at Lainey. She's like, oh, my gosh, she's running to the monkey bars. But, you know, she got it. She's doing really, really good. And Dale is looking at Lainey. He's like, girl, you got this. You got this. Just She's like, Dad, I don't want to embarrass myself in front of Mom. Oh, you got it. Just focus, focus. Look at you. You're going. What's the problem? Why do you look so discouraged? I don't know, Dad. I just, mm, I don't know. I just feel, feel like I don't want to fall in front of Mom. You've worked so hard to show her this. Yeah, well, you got this. You got this. Just keep going. Lainey just learned how to actually ride her bike and her mother could not be happier. She's like smiling from ear to ear, you guys. And Lainey knows how, oh my God, look at Lainey go. Look at her go, you guys. She learned how to officially ride her bike and she thinks she is all that. Now look at her, she's just like sitting here pedaling. I don't necessarily know if she's supposed to just be sitting here pedaling, but um, we are actually gonna have her get off her bike now and now that she knows how to ride her bike everyone is ecstatic so she's gonna go ahead and put her bike in her inventory and her mother is like oh my god i love you so much thank you for she's gonna come over here and of course give her husband some physical intimacy and give him a kiss and oh my goodness and he's like i told you you was gonna get it laney boo i told you you was gonna get it oh my goodness and she's like thank you so much dad for having me and helping Helping me work on my bike riding. Now I can bike ride with all of my friends. She's like, okay, go get your bike and put it in your inventory so we can go, kiddo. Okay, I got it, Dad. Okay, let's go. We just made it home. It is a little bit dark outside, and Amy is actually in here getting some work done, but they never miss a night of tucking Lainey in. So I think that Dell is gonna come here and he is going to praise for her effort. He's like, you really really did something today kiddo you really did your best I'm so proud of you she's like oh my god I know I learned how to ride my bike but you're like yeah I'm so proud of you kiddo but we do need to get you to bed so let's go ahead and cut off this tv while you're watching sports she's like dad I I'm really into sports okay kiddo but I want to tuck you in so let's get you let's get you to bed okay 
Oh, all right, Laney Boo, go ahead and get in a bed and let's tuck you in. Okay. <laughs> so what he's going to do is he's going to come in here and he's actually going to tuck in Laney. He typically always tuck her in when she is, of Aww. course, he's just like, I'm so <laughs> proud of you, kiddo. I love you so much. Everyone is sleeping. It is super dark here in Copperdale. So I'm going to go ahead and let everyone sleep tomorrow. We are actually going to have a fun day because we are taking... And Lainey Boo over to San Sequoia. It's actually Thursday, I'm sorry. But we are taking Lainey Boo over to San Sequoia and then we're going to take her out to the fair. They promised her a good summer because she is actually out for summer break. You guys are probably like wondering, like, why isn't she in school? She is currently out for summer break. And this is unfortunately also the summer where Lainey Boo kind of got some tragic news. I'm not going to spoil it, but she is super excited. We're going to go ahead and let everyone sleep. It looks like Lainey Boo is actually up for whatever reason. I think she has discovered monsters under her bed. So, of course, she is going to tell the one person that she knows that is always going to protect her. She is going to come in here and wake up her dad. And, of course, her mother never believes her that she has monsters under her bed. She's like, you are just hearing things, kiddo. She's like, dad. So, she always has to go to her dad. She's like, dad, dad, bed, dad, dad. Oh, my God, there's monsters is under my bed dad wake up what are you doing wake up okay 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 Jeez, Lainey, what is it? What is it? Mom, wake up. Dad, mom, there's monsters under my bed. Can you please come, please come see? Okay, 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 kiddo. Okay, please show me. Okay, not bike here. I'm sorry. Please show me where there is monsters under your bed. Uh, Dale's like, oh, kiddo, what do you have in here? It looks like, smells like there's monsters under your bed. Okay, kiddo, I'll spray. Babe, you can go back to sleep. Uh, no, I got it. I got it. She's always bothering me. Okay, there we go. Defeating apparent monsters under her bed. She's like, okay, Lainey, I sprayed the monsters under your bed. Oh, okay. Well, now I'm going to go back to sleep. You do whatever it is that you want to do with the information. And Lainey's like, I'm going to ride my bike. Kiddo, get in this house and go to bed. Okay, mom. Okay. After I use the bathroom. Oh, and she's like, oh my God. She, Lainey is like, oh my goodness. I learned how to ride my bike today. I am super excited. And even though it's three o'clock in the morning, I cannot wait for tomorrow. Uh, apparently my parents are taking me to San Sequoia, but I just want to ride my bike tomorrow. I literally just want to ride my bike. But she is super excited for tomorrow. And you guys, she cannot wait until in the morning because they try to take Lainey. When she was a toddler, they took her to San Sequoia literally every single day you guys so she can play in the splash pad and in Lainey's mind you guys she thinks that she is so much older she thinks she is so much older so much better than you know what she was in her toddler phase but in her parents eyes she is still their little Lainey boo and they are going to take her tomorrow to San Sequoia even though she thinks she's older and the splash pad is for babies they're taking her to the splash pad tomorrow so hopefully she still has fun even though she thinks she's older than everything but I'm gonna go ahead and let everyone finally go to sleep and I'll talk to you guys in the morning it is early in the morning here in Copperdale and it is officially the day that everyone has literally been waiting for a day full of fun full of activity full of things to do so our first thing that we want to do is get Lainey fed get everyone together so that is kind of like what Amy strives on she always strives on waking up and making sure that there is a full cooked meal at the table but of course she does have to come in here use the bathroom brush her teeth get all of her things done and she tries to have food on the table before Lainey wakes up so that is something that she prides herself on and Dale is still sleeping as well Lainey Boo has a good amount of time before she wakes up so it seems like Amy does have a lot of time on her hands and a lot of times she doesn't have to rush to get everything's done but she is going to definitely cook Lainey's favorite but we do need to come in here and kind of like 
to clean up. So that's what we'll do this morning. But she is just like thinking, oh, today is going to be full of enjoyment. I know Lainey is getting so much older and she thinks she's way too good to go over to the splash pad, but we're taking her. I don't care. We are definitely taking her and she's going to come in here and make sure Lainey is still asleep. She wants to make sure she's still asleep. And she's like looking at her. She's like, okay, yeah, she's still asleep. So I have time to clean up and just get some things going. Lainey, this is all Lainey, you guys. She has told Lainey numerous times to throw food away and make sure she is not just leaving things here. And apparently, Lainey hasn't got the memo. Lainey it still leaves everything around. So it's okay. Mom got it. We are going to serve some breakfast. Um, we may do some, I don't even know what we're going to do. Maybe we do Lainey's favorite, which is French toast. She loves French toast. It's literally her favorite food. And um, just a little bit of detail in the very beginning. You guys may notice that in her teenage years, Lainey it doesn't really eat a lot of breakfast dad really doesn't cook a lot of breakfast and the reason for that is because Amy always takes care of the breakfast in the house she always typically makes sure that there is food on the table in the morning and breakfast is kind of Amy's favorite thing like it's something that she you know she left her memory there and no one has picked up the memory because obviously it's too painful so she is really the one that you know always makes sure that breakfast is on the table but right now she is going to go ahead and cook and we're gonna go ahead and wake Adele up Dale is really smelly this morning so he is like oh okay it's time for me to get a bath time for me to get myself together he's gonna come in here get a bath use the bathroom brush his teeth and all kinds of stuff like that but she is super excited and I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of this please Please don't talk to me. We did brush our teeth, but she does feel like from all of this cooking, she does typically feel like she's going to probably put this down for, we'll say that she's going to put this down for Lainey because she never typically eats first so she's gonna go ahead and put that down but she does feel like her hands is dirty so i'm gonna have her come in here wash her hands brush her teeth again because it seems that she didn't get to do that this morning and there is laney boo laney boo it is officially time for you to get up my girl she is like mom i smell the fresh smell of french toast it smells so good in here and oh my gosh she does need to brush her teeth she did just wake up she's like mom mom where are you mom um, I'm in here, Lainey Boo. Go over there, brush your teeth, and come eat. Mommy fixed you some breakfast this morning. Of course, I fixed your favorite French toast. Oh, really? Yes, I fixed your favorite. She's like, oh, mom fixed my favorite breakfast, which is a French toast. I already have your plate over here, Lainey Boo. Come over here and eat. Okay, mom, I thought... I thought I was going to have to oh, grab me. Cool. No, I got your <laughs> got your food. That's like, good morning, Lainey Boo. Hey, how are you this morning? And they are having a nice family dinner. And oh my goodness, the table is a little bit quiet this morning. But I think that she's like, hey, babe, how was your sleep? Uh, it was... Uh, it was good to be expected. She's like, oh my God, you look beautiful this morning. Oh, Dale, stop. And Lainey is just like thinking, okay, well, I'm not even going to talk to my parents. I'm just going to be quiet. Well, it was good. Thank you for fixing me some food. Dad, I think she's going to come over here and just talk to her dad. She's going to be like, um, I think she's going to come over here and probably just give him like a goofy story. And I think she's going to probably go over there. Dad, so can we ride my bike? Can we, can we please go outside? and ride the bike i want to ride the bike today i'll throw your plate away but please i want to ride the bike today kiddo we actually have a ton to do you know your mom always you, you know your mom has planned our day out already per usual she's like yep and i'm about to go get dressed and i suggest you to do the same okay oh my god laney what's the matter hun uh, nothing just washing dishes doing my chores per usual and Amy is in here she's like oh this kiddo is so crazy she doesn't want to do anything but I'm gonna go ahead and get into my swimsuit and we are heading over to San Sequoia as soon as Lainey get herself together so she's gonna come in here and just watch some TV because Lainey is dragging her feet around she's like dad I really just want to watch ride my bike today she's like Lainey you know that your mom wants to take you over to San Sequoia we are going to the fair at least later on she's like oh really the fair yeah i'm not excited to go to san sequoia dad i'm a little bit too old for the splash pad 
Okay, Lainey, but you know your Sub mom wants you to go <laughs> over there. She's like, okay, okay, fine. Go get your uh -huh. swimsuit on, kiddo. We are going to be heading out soon. And I'll bring you back home to ride your bike. Well, maybe I can talk mom into letting you bring your bike to the fair. Oh, okay. That sounds great. All right, Lainey, come in here. Go ahead. Get your clothes on. You know, you have to put on your swimsuit. Go. Let's get ready. And I think that... Uh, but I think that Amy is like, I heard you. She can bring her bike. She can bring her bike. Babe, I'm, I know, I know, but just take your time. Like, Dale, babe, I need you to go put on your swimsuit too. Okay, hun, okay, so we can hurry up. And I know you are super excited to take Lainey over there. Yeah, I am. And you two are dragging your feet around. Mom, I'm doing dishes. I'm doing what you always ask me to do. And I think Lainey is going to come over here and she's just going to give her mother a hug because she doesn't want her mom to think that she is ungrateful because she doesn't want to go to the splash pad. She just really prefers like riding her bike. But it is a tradition that in the summer we take Lainey to the splash pad. She's like, I love you, mom. I'm sorry. She's like, it's OK, kiddo. Let's let's go. Yeah have officially made it to the splash pad and Lainey is super excited and she's like babe are you happy to be here he's like yes and Lainey's gonna go up here and play in the water and she's just like talking to Dale she's like babe we are gonna probably end up when we leave here we're gonna go to the fair okay babe I'm, I'm okay with that but they are looking over here and Lainey's like hey I'm not gonna play with the water by myself okay babes okay okay yeah let's go ahead and play in the water and they are all jumping Ooh, around and she's like oh mom watch this watch me go over here watch me go over here under this one this one is the big one and she's like okay i'm watching you i'm watching you go ahead oh we do have to play with the well too you know when you was a baby Lainey, the well was your favorite she's like mom come over here come over here okay okay Lainey, just a second look at dale dale's like i'm gonna go over here on this one this one seems a little bit more fun than the ones that y'all are playing with but she's like okay she's like Oh, Lainey, this water is so cold. Are you having fun? I told you you will still enjoy it. She's like, oh, mom, okay, I'm going to go over here to the well. Fine, let's come over here. Let's go together. Come on. She's like, come on, mom. You're taking too long. You're taking too long. She's like, oh, this was my favorite well when I was little. You are still my little girl. And you, even though you want to be so big, Lainey, even though you want to be so big, I love you so much. Lady Boo, oh my goodness, I love you so much. And she's like, you are still always going to be my little girl. Well, what about dad? He's like, can I do it? He's like, babe, you're so beautiful. Thank you, babe. Thank you. She's like, thank you. But hey, the water isn't going to play with itself. Come on, guys, let's go play with the water again. And he's like, come on. Why is everybody standing around talking, getting all sentimental? Come on, let's go play in the water. And oh my God, Amy is just like, uh, Dale, you are so funny. We do need to leave around two o'clock, guys, or maybe three, because we do need to make sure that we get over to the fair in time. Because Eleni Bug, don't you want some ice cream? She's like, oh, ice cream, yes. Okay, well, I'm going to actually come over here and use the bathroom, Mom. I'm going to use the bathroom before we leave. Okay, I actually am going to use the bathroom as well. So, yeah. And, oh, there's a little girl that Lainey could possibly talk to. Maybe a childhood friend. I don't know. But it seems like she's over there having some fun. She's like, Lainey, boo, I'm going to come in with you, okay? Okay, Mom. All right. Oh, well. All right, so they are over there, and I think that Dale is probably going to find somewhere to actually change his clothes. He doesn't necessarily want to change in front of everyone, but he did bring his clothes behind. He's like, hey, babe, I'm going to go over here and um, change my clothes. Okay, babe. Uh, Laney Boo, where are you going? I'm going over here to play with the um, bars. Is that okay? No, we're actually about to leave, Laney Bug. Come back. Okay. All right, come over here and change your clothes as well. All right, Mom, Dad. We are here at the park, and I am going to go ahead and say that my game is literally broken. I got to figure out which mod is causing this. The only thing that I can get from here is if I buy produce. I do 
Um, I have took out my mod, so I do know it's a mod that's causing it, but that's okay because we do have this over here and we can order a drink or order some food. And I actually don't think a baby girl is hungry or thirsty, so that's perfectly fine. But her mom is looking at her and I think she's going to come over here and say, Hey, Elaine Boo, do you actually want to, um, do you want to go and grab you a, um, what is it called? I think it is a root beer float. She's like, yes, oh my God, yes, mom. I would love to go give me a root beer float. She's like, okay, we'll go over there with dad. And I don't think Amy is actually wanting anything. So she's just gonna come over here and sit down. But she's like, go ahead, kiddo. Go get you a root beer float. Looks like dad got him some lemonade. But I think she's like, um, so she's looking. She's like, hmm, maybe I should get us. Mom, can I get us? No, you can only get a root beer float. Okay, one root beer float, please. She's like, one root beer float, please. Uh, all right kiddo here you go oh, looks like your mom is being responsible for only letting you have one she is and oh my goodness laney bug come over brown? here she's like there was no more seats i'm so sorry hun she's like okay mom well i'll just sit over here on the bench okay well get your root beer float don't forget it and she's just over here she's just sitting down and to be honest this kid really believes that she has the absolute best parents in the world which i mean i honestly i can't even argue with that because she actually does but to be completely honest she has just been feeling a little bit like she's really tired and she's kind of ready to go home but it looks like amy is finally i guess she sat down and it looks like dale talked to amy into getting something from the concession stand and looks like amy is dale is what are you getting what do you have um, I think he has a, another lemonade and I think he talked Amy into getting a lemonade as well And it's just like mom. Is that good? Can I have one? Yeah, I thought you just had a root beer float Well, it was uh, it was okay mom. Okay Well, go ahead and get you a lemonade because we're gonna probably end up going home Don't really like the fair because they the um, ice cream stand is down and I brought you over here to really get some ice cream kiddo All right, mom. Well, just let me go get a lemonade. I'll get a lemonade. That'll be fine. Okay, go ahead and uh one lemonade okay kiddo now your mom is being overboard seems like she's just letting you get whatever it is that you want to get well i have the best parents in the world so it doesn't really matter uh well anyways dad i got me a lemonade mom let me get one okay kiddo well Go ahead and drink your lemonade, and we're going to go ahead and probably end up heading home after that. You don't want to get on any rides while we're here? Uh, not really. I don't really like rides. Okay, well, okay. Everyone is back home, and you guys know Lainey is super excited to be back home because she only has one thing on her mind, and she is going to actually possibly ask her dad, where is your dad actually? Oh, he's outside. He, she's like, Mom, can I go outside and ride my bike? Yes, kiddo, go ahead. Dad is out there, so he'll watch you. Okay, thank God. She's like, oh, I'm super excited. Lainey cannot wait to go outside and ride her bike. It's something that she's been thinking about all day long and amy is just inside she's like okay i am going to probably go outside and play some chess with a dale so she's gonna go ahead and join the game delaney is out here she's like uh okay mom dad i'm gonna ride my bike can you please watch me yes kiddo go ahead ride around i guess just go this don't hurt yourself please be careful She's like, okay, all right, all right, well, watch me. Okay, Lainey, we see you, we see you, I promise. And look at her, she's like, look at her go, you guys. She is super excited. And her parents said that she could ride around. They are watching her. It's literally right there. They can see her. She decided to go all around the world, but her parents don't want her. They know exactly where she's going, so she's okay. But while we are following Lainey, you guys, I am going to actually go ahead ahead and wrap up today's episode i actually enjoyed filming this and it's really wholesome i just love having just that vibe on the channel and i did want to add in laney's childhood because a lot of these things will be impactful to her but she does need to get home i don't know why she she is literally taking it personal her parents can't see her anymore <laughs> but anyways i'm gonna go ahead and wrap up today's video here you guys i hope you guys enjoyed it of course if you did make sure you get this video a thumbs up and i will see you guys in the next one <laughs> bye guys